Hi there, we're at the Mission Grill here in Sister Bay, and today we're going to be making our lobster bisque. You're going to start with a pound of butter. We're going to add uh, four pounds of sweet Vidalia onion, as well as three pounds of lobster bodies. I use lobster bodies to help make the stock. Um, cuts down the price a little bit not using the lobster tails. And you're, what you're going to want to do is let that cook down for, I don't know, probably 15, 20 minutes and start building your stock. After 15, 20 minutes, you're going to want to add uh, tomato paste, paprika, and chopped garlic. Give it a good stir. Basically, you want to simmer that down until most of the liquid is evaporated. And after uh, all the liquid is evaporated, we're going to add uh, 12 ounces of cognac and let that simmer down until most of the liquid is evaporated as well. And then once most of the liquid is evaporated, we are going to add a half a pound of lobster base. Give that a good stir, as well as 12 quarts of water. After the water's added, what you're going to want to do is turn down your heat to about medium and let it simmer for about 30, 35 minutes. Okay, after 35, 40 minutes and everything's been cooked down and incorporated properly, what we're going to do is remove it from the heat and strain all those lobster bodies and onions out of there. This is a large batch of soup, so it is quite labor intensive. Give her a nice strain. After you've strained uh, the lobster bisque, you're going to put it back into a pot. Put the heat on medium. And what we're going to do is thicken that with a little bit of roux. A uh, little bit of butter and flour mixed together and cooked down. Makes a, gives it a nice nutty flavor and thickens it up to, to the right te texture. And we're just going to let that simmer down for, you know, 15, 20 minutes. Cook that roux out so you don't get a flour taste, flour taste in there. Okay, now that we've uh, simmered her down and uh, simmered down the roux and brought everything together, I've added some seasonings of cream sherry, some Old Bay seasoning, as well as some kosher salt and black pepper. And of course, the last ingredient, heavy cream, makes everything silky, wonderful, smooth. Okay, give her a good stir, make sure everything's incorporated. And then serve it up. Nice healthy portion. Excellent. Maybe garnish it with a little fresh chive. Voila. A little bit labor intensive, but well worth it. Or you could always come visit us here at the Mission Grill and enjoy.